Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming in with another episode of Fable 2. All right, and when we left off, I was uh, not where I currently am, but I'll mention it in a second. I decided at some point I was going to go back to the house, back to the family, and just hang out with them a little bit. I got the gifts from the wife and all of that, and, uh, yeah, a couple other things happened. I decided, you know what, I'm going to take the wife on a little trip and we're going to go to Castle Fairfax. And uh, just wanted to see what traders were there. And I saw a lot of traders, a lot of potions traders, with a lot of these particular potions. I bought a lot of them. In fact, I bought two of each up to about level four here. That was impressive that I was able to get that to say the least because I did not expect so many of those to pop up so I did that um just gonna pop them all in a moment but I also found something that in my entire time with playing this game in Castle Fairfax I've never found ever I found a silver key and a path to more of the place that I've never been in before I've never found this path. I saw it and went, holy fuck, I need to record this. So, uh, to be fair, I was doing that just to goof off. I wasn't planning on finding anything, but I did. So now I'm recording it. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to pop these real quick. Yep, here's the path right here. You go, well, to show where it goes. You have to go all the way at the back here, past this little uh, bridge right here. There's a little path downwards, and it leads right over to here. And there's a silver key that is right here. But then there's another little path heading out this way that I've never seen before. Never. And apparently it goes to the tree that's right in here. Again, never found this path, ever. Oh, there's a demon door over there, too. Again, never seen this shit before. So I'm, I'm, I'm discovering all of this on camera as we speak. I'll pop another one of these. Well, hi there. And just where do you think you're going? Places. Oh, I know all about you. Oh, do you? Think demon doors are your little toys to open as you please. Aren't they? Well, not me. Okay. I'm the greatest, grandest, and oldest of all doors. And I open to no one. All right. If you say so. so. run along and find another sentient piece of rock to bother. Okay. That's it? You just open to no one? Alright. What if there's no one in front of you? Is he... Is he watching... No. Yeah, it looks like he's turning his head to make sure I leave. Or maybe that's just my mind playing tricks on me. It's probably that. Let's be honest. Yeah. What do we got? Java die. Okay. No actual Java was harmed in the creation of this robust die made from crushed squirrels. Okay. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that's dark. All right. So how do I get into that demon door? Is it just sitting there to taunt me like well i'm not gonna open for you ever mm. what, what what is the what is the plan for that particular demon door i don't know is it going to be like i don't know would i have to become the king of albion or whatever which i think is a thing eventually isn't it if i remember right anyway uh, I might as well pop all these potions now. I just wanted to get that little thing done. And, uh, shown off and all that. Yep, all the potion traders are right here. I was not lying. Some of them are still walking around as I speak. Okay, and fumbling skill. There we go. I have a lot of them, so this is going to take a while. I should probably pop all of them in one go. Uh, I think that will work. Wouldn't it? I think. I'm not entirely sure, to be honest, on that one. Okay. Alright. Another potion. 
Another one. Okay. And water down. There we go. Jeez, there's so many of these. I did not expect it to be as many as there were going to be. I should probably just cut here and show off after the fact. All right, now I've done them all. I even did some of the, uh, <laughs> some of the, for lack of a better phrase, uh, make me fucking tall potions as well. I did the two of those that I bought. And look, I'm taller than my wife now. How about that? Oh, geez. I am a towering figure. And I don't think she's into that. <laughs> Because she keeps backing away every time we get closer. Okay, now we get the fuck out of here because I have done what I needed to do, which was hang out around Fairfax. Because I figured, shit, I'll never do that. What the? What are you barking at? Dick spot where? Lead me to it, boy. Lead me to it. I'm pretty sure my family comes from a long line of heroes. Oh, yeah? Is it weirdos? <laughs> a bit of both, probably. Bit of both. I'm sure it will grow more. Alright. There we are. And what do we got? Yeah. yeah. Scarlet slime dye. This heavenly hellish hue comes from the slimy discharge of the man eating slug. Although no one has ever confirmed the existence of such slugs, the dye's sole distributor describes them as highly elusive and notably damned. Alrighty. You're the greatest. Well, thank you. You walked up to me just to tell me I'm the greatest. Well, thank you very much. I gotta go, though. Goodbye. Whoops. Helps if I do not do that sort of shit randomly. That's always nice. That was an accidental button press. <laughs> I was, uh... Set up for the wrong game, mentally, in my mind. <laughs> but I'm okay now. Alright. Now we head back home, which is hilariously very close to Castle Fairfax. Now that's what I call a house. It's wonderful. Well, I mean, our house is great too. I've, like, upgraded all the stuff in it and whatnot. Made it all nice and pretty-fied and all that. I mean, our house is great. <laughs> eh, I don't know. It seemed like she was uh, not entirely paying attention to what was going on. Okay, um, that's... I bet this is really romantic. <laughs> not really, it's just dismiss Bye -bye. her follower for now. And, uh, pick up line. Yeah. Okay. Oh, oh for fuck's sake. Sweetheart. Why does the town crier always have to get in my business? This is not your house. Get out, Jim. For fuck's sake. Oh, get out, Jim. Get out. I am married. Not to you. Get out. Alright. Okay, anyway. <laughs> now that I've uh, gotten that out of the way, hanging out with the wife, because why not hang out with the wife every once in a while when I'm done with adventures? Uh, let's see what quests I can do. Um, what? Already? Okay. <laughs> I expected this to pop up after I was done with the, with the spire. I almost forgot the ability to talk there, but, uh, yeah, apparently Not Whole Island is now suffering from the drought that they intentionally made me cause because they needed no more snow for whatever reason. So, let's go back and deal with this because they apparently need me to deal with it because I'm the only one who can. See, that's the problem with forcing yourself into a niche that a company or whatever needs you in because eventually... They will not be able to get you out of that niche because you forced yourself to be too valuable to them. And that's a problem. I'm currently in that problem right now. <laughs> now I can't leave. <laughs> Alright. 
Let's go back to the chieftain. Hi there. Oh, you. Yes, it's about time you came back. Look at the mess you've left us in. You it's made me do it! beautiful island into a desert. You asked me to do it! And it's entirely your doing. You asked me to do it. Here. This is your and doing here. You claim credit. that you make amends. You can suck you can my balls. By retrieving the storm totem from the summer shrine before we die of thirst or lack of personal hygiene. Lack of personal hygiene. Fine. I'll bring the, the rain. People think it's easy being chased. If it'll shut but you I have to make all fuck. the big decisions. Do they ever think about that? Oh, I want to strangle you. Good, good. Uh, the summer key is buried uh, over there somewhere. Well, you don't expect me to find it for you, do you? I know you wouldn't, but I would have been happier if you did. You son of a bitch. Okay, come on. Come, kid, come on, man. Who wants your silly autograph anyway? I just want to get out of the house, man. Okay, come on. Yeesh. Don't you? All right. God damn. All right. Well, let's what talk to the general like? goods guy. See what he's I'll got. My best to serve. Well, I hope you do. Um. Luxury cupboard. I already have one of those. Um. Come hither, dear. Do I not. Don't I already have that? This. I don't. I don't. You're right. I don't. That's a fine I need item. It. I need it now. Okay, and let's see what else I can sell off. <laughs> How did I collect 16 of these? I mean, I might as well keep them <laughs> if I have them, but still. How did I collect 16? How the fuck? Alright. Objection overruled. Okay. Oh, yeah, this thing. The grumpy rabbit. I didn't find yeah the rest of the story, but I did find something involving that. Hmm. Put the egg in the large basket nearby. I remember doing that, doing a bit of that. The last thing, the color of regality. Eh, don't necessarily need that. Average desk table, I can sell oh, that for sure. I'll keep the loot. I'll keep the loot. As long, as long as it lets me play doofy things on the fucking loot, I'll keep the loot. Java die. Dava D, Dava die. Okay. Didn't sell that because it's not really worth keeping it around. Play dead. Didn't I? Yeah, I do have this. Come fucking back sell that off. Uh, artist seduction. Huh. There's some of these that I have not used. I should probably work on that. Scarlet Slime. Wow, that is a really bright red. <clears throat> My throat is really trying to die. <clears throat> I apologize for that. Alright. Although no one has ever confirmed... Yeah, I already read all that. Screw it. Buy clothing. Did they have anything else? Oh yeah, I sold them all of these. Because I didn't need them anymore. That's right. That's right. I remember now. There's another shopkeep around here, if I remember right. There's a shopkeep of some kind. It was There's her. No one quite it was like her. You. That's right, the cosmetician. You're my favorite, you are. Oh, am I? One would hope I spend a lot of money at your place. Not to mention I own it. Okay. Um, holiday weight potion. Wow. <laughs> Uh, trouser feeling a bit loose. It may be time to expand your waist. Yeah, about that. That's that's a thing. Sure. Mild exercise. Silly shrinking potion. Eh, don't really need that. I'd Wait, love to have your autograph. Oh, no do I have any autograph cards? I don't think I do. Uh, man. I'll see if I do, and then I'll try. Yeah, all of these are shrinking potions. Mainly. Yeah, they're oh, shrinking potions. I don't need fan. those. I am tall as hell. Okay. That's... Some of my friends are thinking of starting a fan club for you. Oh, that's adorable. What's with, up with the family? It just popped up with something. Oh. <laughs> okay. 
Alrighty then. Alright, do I have any autograph cards? I hope I do. I do. I have one. I have one. I shall give you an autograph card. There you go. Whoa. I wonder what you'll it's do next. I, I just gave you an autograph card, darling. <laughs> okay. Westcliff's a good place to try. Westcliff? Huh. I have no idea what that was about, but okay. Let's go find the thing. That's half of what I need to do. That is a hell of a fucking... Well, whatever it is. Um, I want to assume, uh, temple? I want to assume? Oh, we go down. Whee! <laughs> that could have broken anybody else's legs. Including mine. Alright. Oh. What? What, doggo? You said that earlier. Wait, what? Okay. What the? Oh, geez. fuck you. you asshole. Oh. Alright. That's what that was about. Why is there a hob? Why was there a hob? Usually these places have only shades on that whole island. Wasn't that a thing? There was only shades? Not really physical enemies? That's new. Hey, 100 gold. Oh, geez. Fuck you. Yeah, these are all physical enemies. This is new. Wow, I'm killing them like they're nothing. Because they are nothing. Okay, they're all dead. I'm going to take all these now. Jeez. It's getting all yellow because of the... Uh, <laughs> it's getting all yellow because of the... Uh, XP suction. For lack of a better phrase. <laughs> okay, what do we got? Oh, there's a thing over there, too. Just hopping along. Is that a book? It's gotta be a book. Yeah. I'll get to that in a second. What have we got? A beggar's ring. That's... That's unfortunate. Alright. Volume 5. Right? Yeah, that's 5. <laughs> I had to think about it for a second. Alrighty. Let's look. Once they had the sun totem in their possession, the Nuthole tribe began to build a village, toiling under the scorching sun, full of joy but parched with thirst. Over the course of the next few weeks, their best warriors made preparations to enter the other two shrines on the island and recover the storm and ice totems. Alrighty. Clearly, they were able to do that. So, that's a thing. Another one? Another one, doggo? I mean, not that I mind. Treasure is treasure, but still. It's starting to get a little distracting. <laughs> you okay, doggo? Okay, there you are. Alright, that was a little odd. A little odd. Yeah. Yeah. What do we got? Amethyst. Okay, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Oh. Clearly, it's right here. And Doggo's going to find it. There we are. And I'm going to get it. Yeah! Alright. Sun Key. This is the key to the Sun Shrine. It feels oddly warm in your hands. Well, it probably feels warm because it's fucking warm out here. There we go. Wee. Good shit. <laughs> I'm surprised... That they're not complaining that the headstones are melting from all the heat. Alright, so I guess we gotta go to the Sun Shrine now. Which I assume was the one we uncovered from the ice? Maybe? I don't know. Maybe, maybe not. Wait. 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 It is. Okay, cool. Cool beans. Unlock. And inside we go. Eventually. <laughs> okay, there we go. 
can learn all their dirty secrets by checking out their stats. Oh, th that's the orbs for the multiplayer thing. Treasure. Immediate treasure. That's always nice. Down we go into the abyss. Ooh. There's the treasure that Doggo was noticing. Yes, Doggo. Thank you. Thank you for pointing it out. Not whole blue. Hmm. They say that no blue can compare to not whole blue, but then the people saying that are from not whole island, so what do you expect? <laughs> fair. That's fair. That is absolutely fair. All right. So, there is a puzzle here. There's going to be some shenanigans involved, I'm sure. Ooh, treasure chest. Might as well open this up. Mimic! No, I'm just kidding. Whole different game. Solemn shrinking potion. No, I'm not. I'm not drinking that. Nope. For those who don't wish to tower over their peers or simply wish to see the world from a child's point of view. Yeah, I'm not using that. I'll take it, but I'm not using it. I'm going to sell it, if anything. All right. So. Three doors. This will lead to one of them. I'm assuming the one in front. And then I assume the flit switches from the ends of the corridors, whatever they are, will eventually come running back over here where I will then use them for one of the other doors. Where it goes from there? Who can say? Hopefully towards the totem that we need. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to end the episode here for right now because uh, this is going to be a whole thing <laughs> in and of itself. So... Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments. We can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and the only Stray Cat. Playing games and getting yelled at by the fucking chieftain of Not Whole Island. Because he's a stupid asshole who takes credit and then blames other people when those things go wrong. Sounds like a certain president that we currently have right now for you.